my name is Lisa and Solomons, and I define as a Cape Khalid, a name which was given to my people under the apartheid regime. Never have I been able to give an exact answer to my ancestry. I know from my mom's side there has been words with regards to Indians and St. Helena Island and then on my dad's side they are more on the fairer side and my dad had green eyes, his dad had blue eyes so I'm thinking there might be some European blood on that line. But other than that I cannot give an exact answer to what my ancestry line is. The research that I've done is that the Cape Colors are made up of Khoisan, Bantu Afrikaans, European and Asian. As a colored woman, I feel that it's important to know where exactly I come from. This will enhance my outlook on life as a Cape colored woman. I absolutely love my culture. In Oostbraai van groot Christmas lunches, confirmations, matriek balls, 21st, boobe, en as jy weet dit net een bykie grey lyk, hy maak ons groot pote so. And for those who do not understand, that is our Cape Colored Afrikaans. And of course, what makes Colored special is that there is not just one culture, which is my Cape Colored culture, as I grew up on the Cape Flats in Balhar. There are many different versions of it. And it also depends on which side of South Africa you came from. Yes, I'm so excited! Okay, so now I'm going to open up the document and it's right here in front of me on the laptop. I'm so excited. Okay, it says a client DNA and it's 15 pages. So it gives you all the information. Um, okay, there's a pie chart. What is good? We traced your genetic history back to... What? Western and Central European, 24.92%. Southern Asian, 24.91%. Oh my God. Southeastern Asia, 12.83%. Yo. South, Southern Africa, Bantu speaking, 12.83%. Southern Africa Khoisan, 8.13%. Central Africa, 4.51%. Eastern Africa, 3.26%. Arabian Peninsula, yo! 2.69%. Western Africa, 2.54% Middle East Yo 2.34% Wow Really? <laughs> what? I can't believe this I am 24.92% Western and Central European and 24.91% Southern Asian that almost makes up 50% and then I, I can't believe that the rest of the 50% are scattered between like Africa so it's like yeah, that's and what amazing. did you and what did you say you I thought you were eh? at the beginning what did you say you thought you were it's not the same as what is I in know in the beginning I said I'm maybe a little European maybe okay some Asian like because when, when I went to Singapore they said that a lot of people said I look like that side of the world oh. Asia. Mm. that's amazing oh my gosh I, I seriously can't believe this is like yo I recommend that everyone does this. How? And to think like my people are mm. from there. Do you know what I mean? Like how like my ancestors have traveled from these different parts of the world down. And I mean there's even a little Arabian. <laughs> like how? 
Yo, that's amazing. Even Middle East. <laughs> I can't believe this seriously. He's from England, Northern Ireland, Germany, Switzerland, Belgium, Sri Lanka, Bangladesh, Thailand, Vietnam, Philippines. Yo, Ethiopia! Kenya! Oh my word! Ah, Congo! Oh my gosh! Cameroon! Yo, Somalia! Oh my word! I'm so excited! Yo, this is absolutely amazing! No, there's Namibia, Botswana is in there as well. Myanmar, Malaysia, Indonesia, Cambodia, India, Pakistan. Oh my word. Oh, I get so excited knowing that now when I travel, I will have a completely different outlook and view on everywhere I go. I'm completely liberated and wow. Just wow. And the truth, you know 